to the memorial. We're literally right here. I've never been this close. We're, actually, we're in the center of yeah, it, right? Let's, let's, go. Go. Let's, go, let's go! Let's go! Washington, D.C. We are here. Hi, right, boys. We've made it. We are at the reflection pool. Got the rods ready. I want to catch a fish right here. I saw Forrest Gump running, yelling for Jenny. Brackley's not going to reenact it, but. <laughs> hey, hey, yeah. Sir, 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 sir. What? Behind the scenes, live action right now. Getting ready to hop in the Tessie with one rod. Lojo's about to come down. We're going on a great adventure. Just about every video I film with Mike usually gets wet. He likes to get in there with the fish. So I'm preparing my mind for possibly going, you know, ankle to balls deep all the way today. I'm ready to go balls deep. Over. Beautiful morning here in Maryland. Let's get this party started. That is not a black coffee. I don't know much about coffee, but that is not black coffee. It's, That's more the black coffee. That's more the consistency this right there. This is nitro juice right here. Why did I get that? Empty stomach. First <laughs> coffee of the day. Yeah. <laughs> Just get, me going. get things. I know you guys are hyped. You want to get the story running. I appreciate that. Now we are fighting with DC traffic. So you guys got to get in the car. Oh, we got to get oh, going. All right. <laughs> Are. Tidal Basin. America's yeah. capital. Yeah. Woo. The Tidal Basin. I saw a monument not too long ago. Mm. Right over there. Look well, at, boys. Look at Mike. Mike's got his red, white, and blue on. Absolutely. Gotta be, gotta be American out so here. patriotic. In fact, oh, I thought that was white. I thought we about white, red, and blue, but not well, quite there. Orange. Not red. Be we're beach mode. But yeah. Hey, I'll say, yeah. you're definitely fitting the vibe in D.C., my friend. All I right. like it. I've like never it. been up here. This is completely <laughs> new territory for me, so what do we got? You've got the mighty Potomac River, the greatest river that runs through Maryland, D.C. And dude, every freshwater species essentially in America swims through here at one time or another. Dang. So you never know what you're gonna catch, and literally. It's, and it's tidal. So it's tidal. Just water level's constantly yeah. changing. And right now it's actually perfect. I'm gonna show you guys. We're gonna fish the inflow. Everything's coming into the tidal basin. The basin is just like a big bowl. So right now the Potomac River is flowing into the basin. All those fish. One, they come in, and two, the bait fish come in, so all the, predator, all the predators stack right to where that water flows in, and hopefully, we can catch some of them. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> oh, my. Some sort of, like, jig head with a little plastic, maybe, uh, maybe a boot tail, like the saucy, something of that nature. I feel like that will catch just about anything in this current literally current situation and we got a bunch of different species I think we'll we'll hit that so I think I'm gonna start with that but I'm also feeling like maybe even that rip bait could be good a yeah. spinner bait something that's like bait fish imitating the bait fish this is completely different water than, than I'm used to fishing urban environment plus it's it's also tidal i've never fished a tidal fishery in my life besides the ocean so no freshwater tidal so mike are there crabs in here i just don't know if this much tackle is necessary oh, oh, oh. <laughs> my guy you never want to be on the water and not have the bait you're looking for i always carry a whole tackle store when i'm on the water yeah, but now we got two tackle stores. That's, that's we need two tackle stores? I have a third backpack in there, by the way. Two, Three tackle stores. Three is better than one. We're ready, rigged up, finally out here. Planes are roaring above us. This fish should be caught. Let's get over there. Decided to go with the old banger. One rod told me that the average depth out here is like four to eight feet. This thing dives two to five, so I feel like I'm hitting a pretty good amount of the water call. What was that? Something just busted right there. What the heck? There's actually fish here. And there's a lot of planes. Ooh, my first piece of trash. Mike, first piece of DC trash. I'm on. Oh, dude, I was just on. And it felt big, man. Holy moly. A little square bill action, man. Yeah. My guy, first time fishing in DC. He got bit on the third cast. We just passed a gentleman fishing all morning. He literally said, 
Not a single bite. You can't catch anything out here unless you have live bait. Those were his exact words. Lojo, you're a hell of an angler, my guy. This is not an easy spot to fish. Thousands of people walk around this basin every single day. And if you can trick them in artificial, you know you're a damn good angler. I feel kind of confident now that I got that bite. I don't even know what it was. You know what's crazy? Because you said you guessed that we wouldn't catch a bass first. Yeah. That didn't feel yeah. like a bass. But it also felt like a big bodied fish. So. Really? With big yeah. fish? Big no, dude, I, I leaned and he like turned and swirled and just wow. pulled right off. Damn. So, I mean, he had some power. Wow. So hey, it's get kind back of exciting. In there. Yeah, oh, I'm get going. Back in there. Yeah, that's a good sign. We just, just got out here. The movement of the water is perfect. We got an incoming tide into the basin. These are my exact favorite conditions I like to fish out here. Fingers crossed, let's get these boys on some uh, big DC fish. We'll give it about five minutes down here, then we're going up now. Woo, oh, a little fish right there, a little bait fish. And I'll tell you guys what, this right here is the perfect bait fish imitation. In fact, this looks exactly like a fleeing, wounded, or dying bait fish. We've got the new Guggen Two Step. Three treble hooks, if anything even sniffs on this bait, it's getting hooked. I'll be honest guys, I have never fished a walking bait that walks as easily as this. Even with the lightest twitch of your rod, this thing glides left to right, perfect action. I'm sure you're watching on screen how easily this thing walks. This bait, get you a big one. Let's get in there and uh, see what we can catch. All right guys, we've uh, now gone on top. This is actually the true basin part. So we were on the river just a second ago. This is the basin. It's a giant bowl, as you can see. You can see around the whole thing. Everything comes in here on the incoming tide. Now, we haven't had any luck yet of landing fish. Lojo's had a couple bites. In that bucket right over yonder, we've got some live bluegills. So, you know, we got the live bait. Why don't we improve our chances of catching something and uh, throw that out as well? Might be something huge out here. Look at that action, baby. Look at that action. Look at that action. <laughs> we're just, hey, dude, right mean that here, live bro. fish? You don't gotta even cast it. We're just gonna drop her right here. Right here, my friend. Oh, it's gonna get pummeled. Dude. I've caught, no joke, right in this corner, I've caught over 30 fish. Come on. Bojo's on. Come on, baby. You got this. Oh, it's a good large belt. Come here. Come here. Oh, let's, yes. go. let's go. Buddy. Let's go, Washington, D.C. We are here. Dude, that's a good one. Look how he ate it, dude. Oh, crushed it. Look at how he ate that. That is awesome. Look at this background and everything. Oh, please. Nuts. That's a pretty decent Yeah, buddy. Dude, he, congrats, dude. He congrats. Hit it, he hit it like a ton of bricks, Ooh, I'm let me telling see that you. fish, man. What's up, yeah, guys? Man, yeah, man, what's, what's up? What's, what's up? up? Guys. Oh, beauty. Hey, this, this is my first Washington, D.C. bass of all time, man. What's up? What's up, what's up, what's up You guys, what's up? You guys what's fish up? out here? What's, what's up, Andrew? What's, what's, what's up, man? What's, what's up? up? Dude, I watch y'all's videos. So we just got out here. I'm oh, running the hat cam. I like that, my guy. The hat cam? Yeah, my These man. These guys have never been to D.C. or fished yeah, to D.C. No, this is literally no. our first fish of I've the day. I've only been in D.C. for like an hour when we got our first fish. Yeah, yeah get a picture. Yeah, yeah, plenty. This is history. The yeah. first time you get to come Seriously. to Maryland. Let me release this fish real quick. We'll get some more some, uh, some pictures with these guys. But first largemouth of the trip. Healthy little largemouth on the banger. Beautiful fish. Thank you, guys. Oh, hey, great meeting you guys. Y'all take care. All right. Let's get our splotchy friend back in the water. So cool, took he was right actually he was out a little bit. He was out a little bit. But I was, I gotta be honest, I was following you looking for some deeper water because everything we just kind of waded through was really shallow. And as soon as I saw this corner right here, I knew it was semi deep, just first cast. You literally caught that on the base of the uh, Jefferson yeah, How crazy. many people can say That's that? Crazy. Let's catch some more. Yep, so we started at where the first inflow is. This is the second inflow in the tidal basin. There's only two. This is where the water is usually moving, but honestly, I think we're at slack tide to tide. Tide charts are not always exact, so we are actually at slack tide, high tide, which is pretty, it's still okay, but when it's slack, the bite starts slowing down, the water's not moving, the bait's not getting stirred up as much. Just takes a little more effort to get them to strike, but uh, hopefully we get number two soon. Oh, I'm on. You're kidding me, right underneath my feet. Oh! You're kidding. <laughs> Dude, yes. Dude, we're about the I same size. I can't believe I just 
flip that thing over that wall. Dude, banger might be the deal. The banger is the deal, my friend. Nice. Look at how look at the chunk, dude. Look at the back meat. Look at how healthy these fish have been. Look at the noggin, but he's short. He's like like a 14, 15 yeah. incher, but he is just We're not stacked. used to these true northerns like this. <laughs> they are stacked. little footballs. Dang. Yeah, so I, cool, man. I think the banger, and this is like my favorite color these days. I think that's Mondo the shotgun, shad. or that's Mondo yeah. Shad. But the shotgun shad, Mondo Shad, these are like my colors these days. That's slightly okay. stained water. God, I'm just on a roll in Washington, D.C. right now. That one, that one bit like right underneath me too. Freaking sweet. Let's get this fish back. Man, I'm starting to become a fan of this uh, East Coast bass movement here. See you later, bud. I perform. That's all I know how to do. Now this is like the perfect area for a banger. It's like three to five feet deep on the edge of this walkway. It's shaded. Oh, there's another one. You're kidding me. What is that, Mike? Smalley! 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 <laughs> I got a Smalley! <laughs> Oh, you are on fire, my guy. Oh my gosh, I am on fire <laughs> Every right time now. I look over, this guy's hooked up. It's oh incredible. Oh my gosh. This is largemouth in here. No, no, dude. You can catch anything in you here. pliers? Pliers. Pliers stat. <laughs> pliers stat. Dude, I'm Freaking liking this small. wall with the wind. I think yeah. that's, this is it. Okay. So I'll tell you what. We're going to walk the whole wall and fish along the entire wall. That's a very strong pattern to fish. So I was surprised we didn't get bit over there as much. That's more slacky. Yeah, that yeah. could be it. We got the wind over here. But dude, I never get the chance to catch smallies. <laughs> so this is like so exciting. This, this awesome, is dude. epic right here. And all these fish are so yeah. stinking healthy. Look at the man. shoulders on it. Beautiful fish, my guy. Man, it fought so much harder too. Oh, it yeah. went crazy when I hooked it. Look at that little small mouth. That is just awesome. What a fishery, man. This is crazy. What a fishery. Yeah. I am blown away right now. Th there's a thousand Gosh. people out here yeah. right this second. And there's dude, people everywhere. This fish should be caught. A lot of anglers, too. Look yes, at that sir. beautiful fish, man. Unbelievable. Spallies are awesome. Yeah. That's number three. I never get the chance to catch smallies where I live. Personally, it's just largemouth and all of your typical freshwater species. It's crazy to me that all these fish are coexisting. There's so much bait. We haven't even caught some of the fish that we're targeting. So, great start to day one. I'm gonna keep throwing the banger. Oh, that's a good looking cast right there. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. What am I hooked on? I can't lose my banger. You are the only one catching fish out here. This is the <laughs> only color of the banger that I have. It's Mondo Shad, correct? It's, yeah, yeah. You hold this for me? Okay, I'm gonna hold it. I'm gonna take off the GoPro. Oh my, you told us not to get in this water. I mean, don't go in the water because it's very deep, but we're not going in though. Okay. We're not going in. Let me show you what I'm gonna do right here. Are you gonna, oh my. Goodness. Don't try this at home. I'm a trained professional. Ha, ha. If I fall, bro, uh, do you want tell, to... tell everyone it was a good run. <laughs> Teamwork. <laughs> bro, what the F is this rope doing here? Ah, let's, let's go. go Help me up. Let's... Ah. Oh, oh, yes, sir. Oh, <laughs> let's go. No lure. Teamwork makes the Left dream behind, work. my friends. Lojo, I hope you got your 10 pounder now. Dude, we got that. I really appreciate that. I got you. This is the only one of this color that Mike had. I mean, look at all the bite marks it's got on it already from today. I mean, this thing has been getting tore up. We couldn't afford to lose it, man. No, we couldn't. We could not. Woo. Thank you. I, I'm trying to read this sign and just pay it to due respect, but I'm having a hard time. It's like it's almost in a foreign language or something. So I'll. I mean, if somebody can translate that for me, I'm not really sure what that means. Dude, I snagged something. What, what is got? this a glove? What the oh. fuck? Oh, snap! What is that? Oh. Dude, you're right? Dude, we are in a cluster. Oh my god! Bro. Dude, I have. <laughs> Mike, what have a time what? Bro, I mean, I'll tell you what, my guy. This is a Magnum. I've never used one of these personally, but someone out here has been getting lucky. That's all I can say. I don't want to touch this. Oh, 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 dude, look at it. Look at it, bro. Oh, That's DC for you, boys. That's DC. <laughs> I, I can't throw this away, guys. I'm putting it right back where I found it. Usually I try to throw it away. Clean it up, DC. One mag condom at a time going in. Oh, let's keep fishing. Broke show the them, show everything. Son of a biscuit. Lojo! 
I just, dude, I oh. went in the water. I know. To catch man. that for you. Busted the bill oh off. Oh my of gosh, it. dude. What happened? Shoot. What happened, my guy? I gosh? just, I tried to like make a bomb cast. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah, the look worst. At I got a problem Bad here. Much I've ever, I've seen this year, my guy. No, I'm gonna get this out, dude. You can get it out. Worry. You don't want the knife? No, no, look, look, look I got. Oh, okay. I already, oh, wow. I already got it working. For you know me. the trick? Made a little color switch here. The water's pretty dirty, so I feel like that's the kind of paint scheme that's really going to stand out. Plus, Smalley's really like that bright color. Just talking to one rod about this. This Reaction Glass Black Series rod, it pairs so well with a cranking setup. I mean, you can feel every single movement. So sensitive. The tip on this thing is great. It's got the backbone still, lets the fish fight. I haven't lost any fish with it. So this right here seems to be the winning combo right now. Dude, the only thing I can catch out of this dump, Rackley, some dude has been getting very lucky out oh, here. Oh wait, you got another one? <laughs> this is the first time in my life I've caught two condoms in one trip. Wow. No, I've, I've only had one me. lifetime, really. I mean, what's the limit on this? I don't, like, I don't know what the krill limit is, but I honestly think this is probably a PB. Let's get it. Can we get a Guggen length measurement with the uh, scale? Should we do that real quick? Look! Yeah, touch look, the reservoir. Oh, oh, no, dude, squishy! Dude, oh my gosh. It's probably nice and cleaned out by now. <laughs> oh my god, it's 10 inches! Wow! 10 inches, bro! Who is using these? Who is using these 10 inch condoms, bro? It's serious. Somebody's serious. It's a 10 inch, bro. Yeah, no. Oh, oh. Man, how. <laughs> 100 bucks to put your fingers in your mouth right now. No, the, no I'm gonna pass. <laughs> Hard pass, my guy. Hard pass. Jeez, dude. The only thing, dude, at least you guys are catching fish. All I'm catching is freaking, freaking <laughs> Trojan Magnums out here. It's crazy. We've walked to the memorial. We're literally right here. I've never been this close. We're, actually, we're in the center of yeah, it, right? Okay. In the center of Washington, D.C., yeah. like all the yeah, monuments literally. and everything. Yeah. Dude, this is crazy. You got the, you got the uh, Capitol, Capitol building. So you got the Lincoln Memorial. Lincoln. You got the Jefferson Memorial over here. I'm not sure what's back that way. See, but, I did not know. Yeah. You 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 educated me because this is like the center point. And then if you look in every north, like south, north, east, southeast, west. west direction, there's a yeah. giant monument, which is really cool. So we're going to take a look on that. We're gonna take a look around. It's really awesome to be part of history right here. And I know there's a pond, because you told me Forrest Gump, that scene where- Dude, a, It's right where there. Jenny. Jenny! Jenny! You, can you recreate that scene for us, you think, buddy? You know, if they let me in, yeah, I could probably use a cool down. I you mean, wanna you, be you, Jenny? I'll, I'll be, be Jenny, yeah, I'll be Jenny for you. Sure, we can do that. All right, let's walk over here. Hey, uh, there's a reflection pond around here, isn't there? Yes, the pool just over there. What's the, uh, what's the fishing like over there? It is real shallow. Uh -huh. I would be in shock if there's fish. Now, Constitution <laughs> Garden's a bit to the northwest. Okay, so there are sunfish. Gotcha. They're now, small. Now, what's the legality of fishing the reflection pond? Reflection? Reflection pool? Pretty sure you can't have anything in there at all due gotcha. to its nature. Now, so but more than likely uh -huh. cast line on the tidal basin okay. or at Constitution. Now, Forrest, gotcha. Forrest Gump yeah, did Forrest run through it was in there. <laughs> that did happen. I so remember someone was in there somewhere. at one point. Someone was in there, yes. But, but that was a different time. Different time period, yeah. If I brought Tom Hanks out here, you think we could let him <laughs> throw up the cast? <laughs> That'd be hard to say Tom no to. Hanks? Yeah. That'd be hard, that'd Can we hard make an exception? No. Tom would probably do it. Perhaps. Hey, not not like we have that yeah. kind of connection. All right, boys, we've made it. We are at the reflection pool. We got the rods ready. I want to catch a fish right here. I saw Forrest Gump running, yelling for Jenny. Brackley's not going to reenact it, but. <laughs> hey, 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 sir, 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 sir. What? You cannot fish here. What? No, you can't. Dude, I mean, we, probably, we came all the way over here. I, I know, but sir, it is illegal to fish in the pool, and okay. you are going to cause problems. Okay. <laughs> My name is Ben and I'm telling you that. All right, well, <laughs> you heard it His right His name here, is Ben and right. Listen right. to the man, okay? We don't. We can't be getting in trouble, so what we're actually going to do, there's a pond over there that we saw on Google Maps. I think there might be fish in it. Only one way to find out. Let's go. Jeez, Actually, it is this, this might have bass. I mean, I'm not yeah, saying, I'm not promising anything. There could be bass yeah. over here, guys. I don't even know exactly where we are or if we're allowed to fish it, but well, we're gonna throw some lines in. Yeah, let's hurry up before we get kicked out. We have fish here. We just stumbled on a whole school. I think they were gills. I'm not 100% sure, but we've got gills and check this out. Brackley found this on the ground. We're about to whip out the old earthworm, put it on a tiny hook and uh, I'm gonna be honest, I don't think anyone's ever fished in this little pond ever. We could be the first people to ever catch a fish out of here in the history of mankind. Oh, come oh, on. Not. Look at him oh run. Oh my gosh. It's a giant. Look at the whole Look at the run here. 
Oh, it's a magnum. Get him in! It's a magnum. Let's go, baby! Constitutional magnum. Constitutional bluegill, my guy. Dude, I, I think you might be three. the only guy to ever have caught a fish out of here, ever. I, I might How's that this. feel? Yeah. I might that, this. that might make you the most constitutional man alive. <laughs> I don't know I if you know that. I love that title. That is so cool. That's a nice one, dude. That is tricky, a nice bro. One. Yeah, they are real tricky. I can't believe it's that bluegill. Big. Beauty. Tiny little mouth. Right here, right here in the innards, the inner bowels <laughs> of our nation's capital. Mm. Smells like freedom. <laughs> I'm, I'm on two. Oh, oh, Mike's on. Mike's on. on. The first time Let's a go, Mike. bait. All right, I'm gonna let Mike go. Has ever been thrown. Let it go. A Guggen bait has never been thrown in the constitutional pond. Come on. Dude, tough down. fight. A lot of pressure on me. Oh, there you go. Get one. low. Get low. Keep him low. Get in the boat, let's go! <laughs> Look at that baby. Uh, On nice. the Guggen inline spinner. That's so crazy. Sick. That's crazy you were getting more bites than me. <laughs> On the Dude. live worm. Yeah, I feel I mean I just started throwing it. I feel like this out fishes live bait, if I had to say. Perfect hook set right in the corner of the mouth. Look at that. I'll tell you guys what, we just started fishing here. If we can find some deep water, who knows what might be living in here. Yeah, it's so shallow, but yeah. if you did find a deep hole, there would be bass. You there. never know. There's a little bridge and stuff right there. We yeah. probably should yeah. keep working just a little, check it out. little while. Let's the guy go. Pretty awesome. Dude, good harmony? job, gentlemen. Yes, sir. Good Feels job. Good. Me and Rackley cool. on the board, a couple yeah. bluegills. Loja, you're still carrying the team, hey, but. That's okay. Hey. We got the, we've got a multi species thing going on <laughs> right now, which I love, anyways. And then where we are. Yeah. Getting these multi-species bites is just, I mean, this is one of a kind right here. Absolutely. I'm loving Pretty it. sweet. Well, folks, I think that about does it for morning number one in D.C. How really do you guys cool, like man. it? Tidal Basin. Epic. I would say. Totally different than what I'm used <laughs> to fishing, both like the, the urban yep. environment plus the tidal fishery. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah. And I was I was just right shocked to see us. how diverse it is. Yeah. It's crazy. It, it it's is. really special. Fun. I've actually never where we're standing. I've never been to this area, so it's new for me too. So it's that's really, wild. Really That's cool wild. adventure. Yeah, yeah. and catching fish next to <laughs> the Washington Monument, Jefferson Memorial. So I mean, you cracked like three awesome bass yeah, around man. there. That was so cool to no. see. It's been epic so yeah. far. This is only morning number one. Yeah, and I was gonna say, now this spot is cool, but I'm telling you what, the next spot we're gonna hit, you've never ever ever seen anything like this. Oh, the with the glasses, glasses off? Oh, oh, I'm just letting you guys oh know. Shoot. I'm just Seriously. letting you guys know. This spot is cool. <laughs> okay. This next spot okay. is unlike any spot you've ever seen. Right. Okay. Well, make sure you folks are subscribed at home. That way you guys don't miss it. Hit the thumbs up button, all that good stuff. And if you guys want to check out any of the baits, apparel, rods, reels, lines, etc., that we use, head to googansquad.com. Be sure to use one of our codes. Save an additional 10% off from your order. It's the best stuff. Get green, get Guggen. It works, what get can green. you say? <laughs> it works. That could be a slogan. Get green. Get green. Get green, get Guggen. Go green. Over and out. Oh boy.